Welcome to this channel. My name is Omolade Adeyemi. I am the CEO of La Riche Designs. If you are new to this channel, you need to subscribe, like, and share because we are going to be dropping new videos. But we are starting with the elementary, like how to use your machine, how to pass the needle, how to pass your thread, and so on and so forth. We would like you to keep watching our videos. Always like it, subscribe if you are yet to subscribe, and drop your comments at the comment sections of every of our videos. Your darts. Okay. Now welcome back. The next thing is how to pick your darts, how to sew a dart, how to construct a dart with that way of putting it. So you can put some um, two inches wideness of your pieces then you can give it any length. I'm only try to I only try to cut off a piece to show you how to construct how to sew in that. So for me basically what I do is um most of most people use one inch to pick their that but I use 1.25 that is one and quarter of my table to pick my that which is from here from the beginning of my table to this end of my table that is what i use in picking my dad but before i pick the dad by the time i pick this i when i do this i divide this into two which is like this i make a line this is the half then i fold my fabric into two i fold my fabric into two i fold my fabric into two Sorry, I need a chop. I fold my fabric into two equal, two equal parts. Tight. Fold it into two. Then, what I've divided, the half of 1.25, you know I divided 1.25 into two. Then I place it on my fabric and mark it. Then I'll measure the length of my dart. You, you can't really say what the length is now. It depends on the person's measurements. So let me say I'm coming down by five inches. And I'm picking my dart from the beginning of the fabric to this point, which is five inches. So what I'll do is... Hold on, hold on, please hold on. In case you don't know, we have an online fashion institute. We are going to teach you full pattern drafting training. We are going to take you from the scratch how to use your machine to the climax. You are going to be the best designers in town. For more information, visit our website on www.larichedesigns.com. I put my needle at the beginning of the, the chalk, which I've marked. I want to construct a shape from the beginning like this. This is how a dart looks like. This is how a dart looks like. So I want to sew following this shape. So I start, I'm also locking my stitch at the beginning, then I continue sewing. Then I go this way, I go this way, I go this way. Then I come to the end. I try to sew a little more further before I cut my thread because of so so that my my stitches will not move will not losing again. So I, most of the time I don't cut at the end. I come a little and I cut at this part. So that by the time by the time I use my fabric, I use that star, I rub the style, that rub the style very well. And even yet my dart will not loosen. It won't lose. So I make sure I leave some part of the thread before cutting. I don't cut at the exact end. So that is how to pick the dart. Let me take you more once again on how to pick the dart. I'm cutting this off. I'm cutting this off. I'm cutting this off. And I'm dividing, I'm picking my half, which is the 1.25 divided by 2. I'm marking the line. And um, I'm using length five also. Yes, length five. You know, like I said, that looks this way. Most of the time I don't draw. I don't draw anymore. 
I stop drawing because I'm used to I know how to construct like that. But for beginners, you need to draw that shape. Just place your ruler or your tape measure this way. And slant and draw a slant line. A slant line to the end to the point where you can where you get five. Five inches. Then you raise up your needle, put your needle at the beginning of your stitch. You look at the beginning and go and keep sewing, keep sewing like this, keep sewing like this, then to the end of your five inches and go out a little, and go out a little, and cut the thread few inches away from the fabric, like this, and make sure you always make your, your cloth loose and cut the thread at the beginning also. So, see how beautiful the dart is? That is how to construct a dart. Thank you. Thanks for watching our videos. We we'll appreciate you if you keep watching the videos. And not we'll be doing giveaways at every over at every point of our achievement. And we want you to keep watching, keep watching, and keep watching. And if you're yet to subscribe, please subscribe extend your love to us by liking every of our videos subscribe if you're yet to subscribe and very important you need to drop your questions your observations and comment on that comment section thank you
Thanks for watching our videos. We appreciate you if you keep watching the videos. And not we'll be doing giveaways at every over at every point of our achievement. And we want you to keep watching, keep watching, and keep watching. And if you're yet to subscribe, please subscribe. Extend your love to us by liking every of our videos. Subscribe if you're yet to subscribe. And very important, you need to drop your questions, your observations, and comment on that comment section. Thank you.